Is that iPhone app spying on you too? Well, it just might be. I'm Chris the CyberGuy. Follow me at CyberGuy.com and see why so many people get my newsletter for free. Well, don't worry about this. Apple has a built-in privacy report that can tell you what's really going on. It's like your own digital detective. Let's check this out. First, let's find the app Privacy Report. You're going to go ahead and open up Settings, scroll down and tap Privacy and Security. Then tap App Privacy Report. If you haven't already done this, turn it on and tap Turn On App Privacy Report. Apple's going to then track data for the next seven days so you can review how the apps are actually behaving. Okay, let's dive into the report once you got it. Now let's go back to Settings, then Privacy and Security, and tap on App Privacy Report again. You'll see the following information. There are a few key sections here. Data and sensor access. This is going to show you which apps have access to your location, your contacts, photos, camera, microphone, and other sensitive data. Now, if you see something here that doesn't jive with you, like an app accessing your camera when it shouldn't be, that is a red flag. Another section, app network activity, gives you insight into the network traffic generated by apps. It shows which domains or third-party services apps are contacting. This is going to help you identify if your data is being shared with others externally. Now, if an app is contacting advertising or tracking domains like Google Analytics or Facebook, it could mean that your data is being shared for advertising or for analytic purposes. Next, we're going to scroll down to Most Contacted Domains. This shows you which external domains or web addresses and websites that an app is interacting with. This helps you understand where your data might be going. So what do you do with this information? Well, you've got options to rein in your privacy. Let's do it. You can revoke unnecessary permissions, disable tracking, or even uninstall apps that share your data in ways you're not comfortable with. For example, to limit ad tracking, which I've done, open the Settings app, tap Privacy and Security, then Tracking. From here, you're going to turn off Allow Apps to Request to Track to prevent apps from tracking your activity. And you know what? It seems like every time I do this, it reveals some surprising things about the apps I use every day. More smart tips at cyberguy.com. Click the red button and find out why so many other people get my newsletter for free.